guys what's going on. I wanted to talk about an idea that's been on my mind a lot lately with you, which is the concept of sharing goals or keeping things to ourself. Um, what I mean by this is, and, and I've seen a lot of this, which is why it's been on my mind and in the past I've struggled with it as well. The concept is that when we come up with a goal or, or some big undertaking that we're going to try to achieve in our lives, generally speaking, it seems like our first inclination after we set these goals is to immediately start telling people about them. Uh, talking to friends, uh, wives, or, or you know, posting about it on the internet, you know, telling everybody about our goals. But this is actually wrong. This is the wrong way to go about things. Um, what happens when we do this, when, when we take these ideas of our goals and we start spreading them out there to the rest of the world, is that our brain actually begins to confuse the talking with the doing. And it gives us gratification, which is sort of like a premature social uh, gratification because when we talk about it, we get a little bit of that that serotonin or that dopamine from the recognition of people being like, oh, that's so cool that you're gonna be doing that. And we get that little kick off of it and it dissipates our power, it dissipates our, um, our drive to actually accomplish the goal. Um, there's a lot of studies and research that actually backs this up, so I'm not just sort of making this up as I go along. But one of the things that I wanted to talk about is that in the, in the Elder Futhark, which is, you know, the old rune system, uh, which even if you don't know anything about it, that's fine. These concepts sort of go beyond it. But there is uh, two runes that specifically correlate to this concept. And one is called Ingwaz, which looks like this. It's just a diamond shape. And another one, which is called Yera, which is a diamond shape broken open. And the idea of Ingwaz is that it's, a, it's an enclosure. It's a, there's no uh, gaps in it. It's just the inside. And the Yera is broken open. And Yera uh, means the year or the cycle of the year, but oftentimes is taken to mean the concept of harvesting something. So when we're talking about goals, what we're doing is we're taking this sort of compressed, contained energy, and we're letting it leak out too soon. Um, you know, an explosive device needs to be compressed because that's what makes the power generate and explode. But if we, if we leave cracks or if we open things up, we lose compression and so we lose power. It's the same with the motor. You know, if you have an exhaust leak or whatever, or a, a leak in the cylinder, you're, you're removing compression from the motor and motors cannot run without compression. There's nothing to power the inside of it. When we lose compression, we lose power. We can't get anywhere. So one of the things that's crucial about these two runic concepts is that Ingwaz is knowing to keep that power inside and then when you keep it internal, it grows and it becomes much more potent. And Yera is knowing when to crack that open and when to let that power out uh, in order to achieve our goals. So there's a couple of things where, you know, we obviously, if we work in a group setting, if we work on a team, it's okay to talk about the goals to the team because that's still keeping the idea internal. We just don't want to take the goals and talk about them to people outside of whatever our internal, our inside outside is. And that when we do this, when we contain our goals and we keep them to ourselves, what we do is we set ourselves up for consistent achievement. Um, and then it's a much better gratification to actually achieve something than to just talk about it. Plus it lets people know that you are consistently actually achieving things rather than consistently talking about things. And consistent achievement leads to consistency in general, which leads to experience, which leads to confidence, which leads to authority. So anyone who's looking to become an authority on anything, try not talking about your goals. Try not posting on social media about things that you're trying to do before you do them. Um, you know, unless you're talking about, you know, doing something with someone else or, or whatever, that's okay. But if it's a personal goal, uh, something that you're really struggling uh, to achieve and that you really want to do, keep it to yourself and let that power generate like a dynamo and keep the compression there. 
Uh, this is just a little tip, something that I've been thinking about a lot this year, and it's helped me over and over. The more I keep things to myself, the more they germinate and the bigger the idea comes, and, and the more riper it is before I crack it open and I harvest it. So just something to take home and put in your pocket. 92, guys. Ganga ya ne guna sinir sida na yasa.